What's up Dark Souls fans and welcome back to Praise the Sun. Today I'm going to be taking a look at the Onyx Blade. Got that thing plus five to Blessed Pairing Dagger, Ragged Mask, Fire Link Armor, uh, Hornet Ring, Chlorinthy Ring, Sun Princess Ring, and the Ring of Favor. So taking a look at my build, I'm level 120, got 40 Vigor, 35 Endurance, 35 Strength, 35 Dexterity, 15 Intelligence, and 15 Faith. Starting as the Thief class here. Definitely not the optimal class you want to start with for a quality build, but it's what I got. So, let's jump into the very first fight, and I'm going to show you guys some cool shit. Alright, kicking off our first fight here, who do we got? Arcist. Uh, with Onikiri Nubadashi? I can never tell when it's got all these fucking buffs on it. Alright, so, there is a really cool way to combo into this weapon art. You have to be right up on their nuts. Just like that. Alright, so it's just R1, L2, and it's definitely my favorite combo to do with this weapon. Um, however, if you are not right up on them, uh, you will miss the weapon art. The range on it is actually deceptively short, and so in order to get max damage if you are at a farther range than right up on them, uh, then uh, in that case you just have to swing with another R1. The R1 has a longer range than the L2, so... We're going to get a rebuff here, just in case. I don't know exactly how long this buff lasts. But, uh, yeah, this weapon's great. Um, it's got hyper armor on the R1s, obviously. And uh, just like any great sword, the general strategy is what this guy is doing to me right now. Oh, damn, that actually really sucks for you, man. Ho, 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 hit him. Damn it, it didn't do any damage, though. I don't know if the damage on that increases with uh, with increased faith or intelligence, but uh, that'll be something for the number crunchers to figure out. We're just kind of looking at the moveset, how to use it here. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> We're both just kind of doing the same thing. Oh, that's pretty funny. Man, this is tense. This is too tense. I'm gonna go one-handed, because I don't really need the two-handed damage. And I'm gonna have the threat of the parry out as he starts sweating here. Because my health is regenerating. Whew! I went for the parry, it was not a smart idea. One shot from death here. Oh man! I'm starting off the video with a tie game, holy shit. <laughs> I got Greatest Combatant, though. I'm not really sure what, what determines that. Maybe it shows Greatest Combatant for him on his screen as well, but either way, dude, really, really good fight. GG. Alright, our next fight here, who do we got? Nizian with the Maracas. Alright, let's see what you got, man. Nope. Oh, damn, I thought my hyper armor would start soon enough. Ouch, damn. These high combo damage weapons are very, very deadly in the arena because of the reduced health that everybody has when you do duels. It's very scary stuff. You guys are going to have to let me know what you would rather see, duels or brawls for this series. I feel like duels are a little bit better for this series because it gives me the chance to fight more opponents in the amount of time that I allot for these videos. I did not mean to kick there. <laughs> I don't know if I could have comboed an R1 out of that. It kind of looks like I could have, but... Depends on the recovery speed of that weapon art. I don't know how long it is exactly. Got him! Good fight, Nizian. Good fight, my friend. Close stuff. Really good opening combo there. GG. 
Who is next? All right. Who are you, my friend? Sightless Worm. May we have a wonderful duel. That's some Karthus Curve Sword action. They actually nerfed the uh, damage on that. And I remember when I saw the patch notes, I kind of laughed to myself because I was like, the, <laughs> the damage was never the problem. It was always the speed, guys. Come on. Keep up. <laughs> but uh, that's okay. A nerf is a nerf. I'll take anything. Whew! I did not think I'd hit him there. Otherwise, I would have led that up with a... Uh, I would have finished the combo. So I gotta be really on point with my reaction rolls. Because if I panic roll at all, that Karthus Curve Sword is gonna eat me alive. Bam. Should have done the weapon art combo, but that's okay. Damn! Nice fucking read, dude. Really, really good stuff. I thought he was gonna go for a rolling attack for sure. Gotcha! Good fight, Sightless Worm. Good fight. And one of the good things about the uh, the poise patch increasing everyone's hyper armor is uh, it is kind of like a roundabout nerf for the Karthus Curve Sword and uh, super fast weapons that kind of follow that strategy because they can't really swing without, uh, without worrying about being um, destroyed by hyper armor anymore because hyper armor starts so early. So good fight, Sightless Worm. Another slain. That's a pretty badass name, actually. I will not be your next slain victim, sir. So we got Icy Karthus here. Gotta watch out for those laser beams. Woo! Gotta work on that spacing, son. Ooh, and roll timing. Gotta watch out for that stuff. And that hyper armor, bro. Gotta watch out for all those things. Damn it. Ah, I wish the weapon art had hyper armor on it so much. Okay, that was good. That was good. Got him. Good fight. Good fight. He was expecting me to roll away and be scared of that weapon art, but we have no fear. Not with Hyper Armor. With Hyper Armor, there is no reason to ever be afraid. And who might you be? Oh, he's naked. Ash Emberman. Okay. Well, that was a waste of my time. Good fight. He's probably gonna pull out Smo's hammer if he actually managed to land the parry. Didn't really work out for him. set up here. Ooh, some good S-Stock action. It's release week all over again. Damn, thing is fast. I haven't fought the S-Stock in a while, like, you never see it since it was nerfed. Surprised that wasn't a roll catch. Actually, I'm not. It's Dark Souls 3. You can't catch rolls in this game. It's a myth. Wow, that was really, really sick. And then he tried to go for the swag backstab off of the berry. Too bad for you, man. Now you're going to get the business. You're about to get this work, kid. Going to rebuff. About to get this work. Mm -mm -mm. 
Well, this isn't uh, annoying at all. Darn. I wish roll punishes weren't a myth, you know? The stuff of legends. But! Poise parries are not a myth. Or face tank parries. Wow, that did no fucking damage. No! That's so not good, guys. That's not good. I was expecting it to be over there. There's no way he's gonna let me do that again. This is really annoying, dude. Now I realize why everybody has an offhand crossbow in this game. I'm really wishing I had one now. But we don't even need it, bitch! Don't even need it! Where's my point down, dude? Do I even have one? Eh, I'll just do this. Eh, eh. <laughs> Good fight. Alright, and for the last duel of the video, who do we got? Oh, it's a fucking rematch. Let's see if Nizian can, uh... Can get this run back on me. We'll have to see. It's not looking good for him, but he could probably kill me in a single combo if he manages to land the Super Maraca Fiesta. But it's not gonna happen! Good fight, Nizian. Good fight, my friend. Sorry you couldn't get the run back, but that is it for today's video, ladies and gentlemen. I will see you for the next one. Have a fantastic day, and praise the sun. Later.